Hey, come on, guys. Let's play. Hey, what's up, Rock Flock? This is the Master Gamer Rockhawk64, welcoming you back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time Master Quest. Remember in our last episode, we explored this area here. <clears throat> and we got two Skultulas. Oh, no, we didn't, we didn't get two Skultulas. We got two of the torches lit. In this episode, we're going to hopefully continue on. Sorry about that, but yeah. So I think I might have missed a gold Skulltilla back here, so I'm gonna go check that out really quick. Yep, I did. So there's that gold Skulltilla right there, don't forget that, like I did. <clears throat> Anyways. Uh, see, there was something I wanted to do and I didn't remind myself. And that was I wanted to put a Fire Wars Wind warp, warp point here in this first room. But oh well. Anyways, now that we've got our fairy bow... We can shoot these eye switches. Like so. And... Nope. Like so. Boom. So we're going to go this way first. Sorry about that, we went in the wrong door. Uh, that whole section will have been cut out, hopefully. Future Rock, cut that section out. Jeez. There you are. Okay, yeah, so the other one is here. Don't like your face. And I especially hate your face. Let's see. Okay, I don't think we can get that one until later. So I'll just meet you guys back on the other side. Nailed it! That I have found is, believe it or not, one of the most satisfying ways to beat those guys. Nailed it! Anyways... 
We see this well here. Boom. Yeah, we drained the well. And we have... Come on. Open, please. Small chest here, which has... We got a key! We got some health. And right down here. Another gold skull tulla. Noise, noise, very noise indeed. That's the gold skull till I was trying to get earlier. Now we gotta go back to the other side. And then, what we need to do... Is we need the Ocarina. We need the Ocarina of Time. Damn it! Wrong song! There we go. We got it. This is the... Oh no wait, fuck, wrong song. That's what we wanted. I forgot it's the song of time to make those time blocks do their thing. Oh, yeah. Come on. <laughs> Hang on a minute. I'm just going to levitate in midair while I put my hook shot away. <laughs> Zelda logic. Do you guys see that? You know what? Let's just catch an instant replay of that again in slow mo. Ah! <laughs> that was hilarious. 
Anyways, we get a small key. And then we pull out our trusty, rusty hookshot here. And... Now we got two ways we can handle this. We can either shoot an arrow through the fire to burn the pillar, or we can burn some magic. I'm not necessarily a big fan of burning unnecessary magic. And this is the way that we're supposed to do it anyways. Out. Ow. Come on, jeez. Die already. Oh, sorry about that, guys. I cut that out because there's a whole lot of them ganging up on me. And now if we take a look at the map here. See what's over this way. Oh god, that was annoying. Um, so anyways, yeah, this video will actually be the only one this week. Ooh. Okay, guys, I'm an idiot. Because I just now remembered the room where we had our missing keys. So, I apologize for all the idiocy. I will probably have cut out just all that useless wandering around. God damn it. Like this! Mm. Getting cut too. Okay, guys, um, sorry about that. I had a big cut because there was just a bunch of me just wandering around trying to figure out what to do. I finally figured it out, though. I'll show, of course, me getting some Skulltillas. But for the most part, pretty much everything I've recorded up to this point has been cut out. Why? Because I derped. I don't think you guys want to watch about 16 minutes of me just derping around. 
Long story short, I forgot about our rooms up here. Where we need the key to go on, so... Now that we've got those two keys... We should have no problems at all continuing on. Most fucked up hallway ever. I almost didn't make that. That could have been bad. Oh, there was one moment that I had to show you guys. Twice. So, but yeah. Essentially, I'll be showing off the important stuff, and maybe that one thing, if that one thing is not in the important stuff. But anyways, now that we've got two keys... You remember how we couldn't get past up here before? Well, now we can, because we have keys. Yes, we know to watch for the shadows of monsters, Navi. Damn it. I want to kill him. Holy shit! 80 rupees! Holy fuck! And here we've got some green bubbles. Their flames will... Uh, remember the blue ones where we had to run into them? As you can see, that is not an issue with these guys. But you can still do that, but it's not a requirement. Anyways. Uh, we've got another puzzle. So yes, believe it or not, there actually are puzzles in Legend of Zelda games. I know, it's, it just comes as a surprise. Who would have thought there would be puzzles in a Zelda game? Anyways, the puzzle this time is rather simple. Go grab a block. Grab a box, put it on that switch. And then it all comes down to hitting that switch there. With an arrow. Damn it. This might take me a few tries. God damn it. Six more shots, six million more seconds to wait. God damn it. Nailed it. And we twistified the hallway. Oh yeah, now there's just one issue. Well, 
long as that switch remains pressed, this door will be encased in ice. Anyways, we dispatch those guys. Pretty simple. Now this way is up ways. No. No, 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 I don't think I was supposed to do that. No, I wasn't. What I was supposed to do is fall down the hole. Here. Oh god, this room! We can't, actually can't go that way yet. We're missing something. Oh, we have no choice but to go this way. Brutus, watch out! The ceiling is falling down! You don't say! Go for where the Skulltillas are. They indicate the safe spots in the wall. Oh! Who cares about the ceiling? We got arrows! And now... Go through here... And we got a key. Wait, wait, what am I doing? I've already got the ocarina. Yeah, I sped that up just because that takes a bit. Oh, so now, I'll make a cut to when we get back to the door. Ah ha ha, stupid ceiling cannot beat me. Dun 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 dun. Dun dun. Ow. Ow. Crap.
That is what you do when you don't want to fuck around. Anyways. On the other side of this door. We see a bunch of blocks up there. What could they be for, you ask? Well... We shoot this picture here. We can see it's a puzzle. not going to complete it in time. Nope. Not going to complete it in time. And if you don't, what happens is the puzzles pieces will flip over and the clock will reset like this. Ooh, racing against the clock. Come on. Boom. And this is Amy. And boom. Amy is dead. That's three of the four torches lit. Now all we have to do is go like the last one. When we come to this door... There is the last of the four Poe sisters, Meg. She's crying because we killed her siblings. And she is the... She's the most difficult to beat. And that's why. You gotta watch them. You gotta have your arrow ready. <clears throat> and that's all you do for this. That's what makes her the most difficult to beat, though, is... 
She's really a waiting game. Oh, ow. It's really punishing if you don't get it right either, so... So if you've seen it gets faster and faster, it just gets difficult to hit her. Boom. Come on. Die. Please. Oh, and they also move with you, so you have to use your arrows here. <laughs> but, once Meg is defeated, this here opens up. And that's where we're going to end this episode off, guys. Next, we go visit where this elevator takes us. Alright guys, I want to thank you all for watching. This has been Rockhawk64, bringing you Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. I do hope you enjoyed the episode. Please stay tuned to the, for the next episode where we finish up the forest temple and fight the boss. <gasps> yes, there's a boss fight at the end of this temple. Don't tell anyone, it's a secret. Shh. Spoilers. Anyways guys, thank you again for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll catch you all next video. So until then, just remember to have fun with life and enjoy it too. Peace out.